Good morning, good morning. John Wendell here with Keller Williams in Frisco, Texas. And today I am going to tour through a home that's in Chapel Creek. I absolutely love this home. I have a five bedroom, five and a half bath, 5,038 square feet. And it was built in 2005 by Darling Homes. And if you don't know anything about Darling, they built a beautiful home and they built all the way through the Metroplex for years. But anyway, you are going to love this home. It has fresh paint throughout it, three car garage, pool, everything you need in the house, you got it, especially for a growing family. It's about uh, five minutes from Stonebriar Mall, grocery stores, uh, shopping, major employers. The three schools that it funnels into is uh, Spears Elementary, Hunt Middle School, and Frisco High School. And so come with me today and let me know if you have any questions. Also, do me a favor, if this is the first time for you to be on my channel, please subscribe to it and then also hit that bell so you're notified when there's more videos that come up for home tours. And, and if you like what you see going through here, if you will give me a little like button on there, touch, I would love. So let's go see this beautiful home. So as you can see, this is a European style. Beautiful landscaping. The whole neighborhood, Chapel Creek, is a, a styled after, a, looks like a European village all the way through here. And homes go up to several million dollars. So this home we're looking at today is priced right now at a million four ninety five. And again, it's an absolutely beautiful home by Darling. Got cast stone, brick. Now let's walk right up here. Got your brick entry. And you have a really pretty courtyard right up here in front. You can always take that center stone out if you'd like and put a table out there. A nice place to sit. Three windows right off of the entry. Metal door with glass. And let's go in and check this house out. Check this out. Isn't that beautiful? Right here in the staircase, black painted banister. Look at all of this right here. Is this pretty? Yeah, with the hand scraped wood flooring with a stone inlay and then coming right back in here right off of the foyer is an office again you have hand scrapes wood very pretty it smells so good in here with that new paint really nice designer colors double French doors built in credenza with bookcases and that view is the courtyard that we had just seen out front. There's plantation shutters through the whole house. Look how pretty this is. You can close off those French doors and not feel confined in here. Yeah, let's go down here now. Do you love that? Is that pretty or what? Come right down this hall. We have a little coat closet right here. Again, it's a five bedroom, five and a half bath. Game room, you're gonna like what's behind those glass doors right there. See their doors, there used to be an opening and they enclosed it. There's gonna be the kitchen we'll see in a minute. But when we head to the left right here, really nice art nook. We're gonna go into the master new carpet in it and these windows are going to be facing south so you're not going to get a whole lot of sun through here in the day which would be really great for sleeping again plantation shutters big old queen or king bed in here I mean look how much room you have on the sides you have nightstands the dresser I'm going to go in here real quick so, here is your workout room, a rubber floor, a mirrored wall, ceiling fan, remember the other side that we're talking about, there's that glass, they mirrored both sides on here, 
that great? Right off of the master. And right off of the pool. So you get a door all the way out. And we're going out to the pool in a couple minutes, but look at that slide, that tile slide. Very, very pretty. Show you the trim work. Didn't Darwin make a great album? Doors are huge. Heading into the master bath. Tile floor. We have a double vanity. Here. Look how much counter space on this one. Really nice mirror. Trail finish on the walls. They're wired for sound all the way through the house. Plantation shutters again in the bath. We have a spa tub. Here's the other vanity. Big old mirror. Look at that right there. Linen closet. Shower. Tile through. Party in the shower. Very nice. Get closer on here. Marble on the tub. Get into spa tub. Get your potty room in there with another cabinet. Double racked, really good space on here. Shoes, built in cabinets, a lot of hanging room in here. There's so many homes we walk into now, and that's something we forget about what's in, what should be in the master uh, closet now. And, uh, no one's getting ripped off in this closet. It's fantastic. Here, that, that gray floor it has a gray tint to it. So the walls are kind of an off gray right now, kind of a dove gray, maybe a little bit darker, and it has a little bit of blue in there. A barrel ceiling. So right off of here for the guest is your half bath. house. Again, the house was built in 2005, but really quality updates that they've done. Look how monstrous this island is. Three bar stools. Dishwasher. Big old sink. Very pretty. Got your Sub-Zero built in there. Really nice backsplash. Compliments everything that they've done in this house. And we have a five burner gas stove. Get your painted brick. And it still has that European feel, doesn't it? Double ovens. steel appliances all through. And look at this right here. Isn't this great? Got your built-in desk out of the way. Some bookshelves. Really nice, pretty arch. And you have 
two staircases in the house. It's great. Kids can run down the back staircase. They don't have to go up the front all the time. Come down here. Terrific. More serving space. Wall of windows. Isn't that great? Has a big old couch in here. And it just doesn't feel that big, does it? It just fits that space so well. Got your built in for your TV. Really pretty fireplace. And the TV up there. So you can rearrange that. You can put in some glass shelves. Change it up. Bookshelves. Whatever you want to do. So that's where everybody used to put those TVs. And now it seems like everybody wants them on the fireplace out here now. Either one. What a great entertaining house. Very, very pretty upscale. And right off of here, you have a full bath. What's great about it is this is the pool bath too. You have the door that goes out to the outside. towels in there. Anything you want in here since it's right off of the pool. And you have another bedroom right down here. Really good size. You have volume of the ceiling. Tree ceiling and you have built-ins here. So this is like a flex room. You could have it as a, another room to entertain in since you have a big old built-in here for a TV. table in here right downstairs or a gaming room now for the kids. They've taken this door off this closet and it's now used for all the electronics in the house. But really, really good size. So it looks like over the years it's been used for several different purposes. It's a really good mother-in-law suite when they come in. Again, downstairs. So let's head upstairs and see what we got up there. So we're going up the back staircase. Again, new fresh carpet all the way up. I'll just show you again the details. Very pretty. So out here in the hall, we have two built-in desks. Great idea for kids' studying area. Designated studying area. Isn't that great? Very, very nice. Didn't clutter up the rooms. Have a designated place. Here's another game room. Step down here. Really, really good size. Use this as a media. Put our big old screen right here. This room doesn't have any windows, so it'd be fantastic for a media room. And let's swing around right here. Check out this closet. You can store a lot of stuff in here. Got some cabinets. That door's into the attic. And then you also have attic entry right here. So this is store the Christmas tree or whatever, all the decorations, whatever you like to store in here. Really nice size. If you're enjoying this tour, I would love for you to click the like button. And uh, give me some comments if uh, you like it or you don't. Again, it's lower 5,038 square feet, five bedroom, five and a half bath, built in 2005, in Chapel Creek, and that is in Frisco. Near everything, all the schools that it funnels into are fantastic. 
Look at this. Everybody has plantation shutters. Those things are expensive. Even the kids have them. Again, it's all wired for sound. Closet. Really good size closet. With a window. And look, more plantation shutters in the wind in the uh, closet. Now, I got a kick out of this, and I want to see if you do too. Have you ever seen a sink this big in a kid's bathroom? It looks like a kitchen sink. Look how big it is. You could bathe the baby in here. Is that great? Take the mirror down so that would need to be replaced. But, uh, granite countertops, stone tile inlay, the floor. And this has a big old shower seat. Looks like this have a spa. Look at this. Double head shower in it's almost like it's another master suite. That is awesome. And I'll head right over here. This is the front staircase. Hardwoods meet us right here. Bathroom for the another bedroom. Very nice. Really good shape. Everything's so clean and just move in ready in this house. Got a bathtub in this one. Back and back out. Another really good sized bedroom. These windows are facing the front of the house. Again, plantation shutters. And you have the view of the courtyard on this here. Really good size closet. Again, all new carpet, paint all the way through the house. They've spent the money on this for you. So you can just come in. That's so pretty. Very nice upscale feel. And we're not done yet. Got this one. Big old room. Closet. Racks. You know, most of the time kids get, you know, kind of ripped off. I know they're not paying for the house, but, uh, you know, their closet space is nothing. And this house has tons of storage area. One window. Two windows, three windows in this room. And in suite. This is a Jack and Jill, but it's so well done. Big mirror. Lights. Guess what? More plantation shutters. Stepping in here, we have a huge shower and one shower head in here, so you don't have to suffer whoever has this room. And then you got here, very, very clean. A lot of counter space. This room has one window, but really good size, and the it just looks so much bigger because the ceilings go high up. Closet, and that is it for the upstairs. I want to show you two more things. Let's head down to the dining room, and then we'll go out to the pool. fantastic day enjoying the tour again it's in Chapel Creek Chapel Creek 
It should be a gated community, but it doesn't have a gate. But there's multi-million dollar houses in this community, and it's so great as far as the location goes that uh, all the new builds have been built out in this neighborhood. And, uh, you don't see too many houses for sale. And when they do go, they go pretty quick, and they go on the market. So here we are in the dining room. Very pretty. We did the trowel finish again. Crown molding. You have a European style now with a kind of contemporary flair to it. This is very pretty. Very, very pretty. And look at that. Look at that view right here. Isn't that gorgeous? Here, the garages are split. So we have a two car garage here. Everything is so clean. Check this out. Can you see all the built ins in the garage? The refrigerator out here with the water line. The fridge is not here, but. And those plantation shutters right there. And that was the three windows that we saw when we first went into the house sink out here very very pretty then we've got a door to the outside laundry room with sink and epoxy floor more cabinets, and this is the third garage right here, off by its side. And let's head outside. It's been trying to rain all day. I think we might have timed it correctly. Let's go out here. Pretty stone. Really nice patio. Again, this is south, so you're never getting any direct sun in here. So what a great area to hang out, entertain. Really nice swimming ledge here, kind of a beach entry, sitting all the way around. A little grotto there with that slide. Got a spa over here on this side. Very low maintenance yard, but you still have grass for the dog and for the kids. You have walking trails all through this neighborhood, which is fantastic. Good sized backyard. Roof looks like it's in really good shape. And that is it for the tour. If you have any questions, leave comments below. Again, I'm John Wendell with Keller Williams Realty, and if you're interested in a showing of this home, you can either call or text me or email me. My contact information, again, will be also below. And if you need anything, please let me know. I'm all over Frisco and Collin County. And other than that, I look forward to you seeing my next video. I put them out every week. And so if you'd like to subscribe again, hit that and, uh, and the bell so you'll be notified each time we have a tour. Have a fantastic rest of the week. Thank you again.